Hi all, welcome back to freshersworld.com. My name is Reshmi Elias and in today's video I will be discussing some questions based on the topic combination. I hope this will be helpful for all those who are preparing for various government exams. This video is sponsored by ReLevel and after a small video we will start our classes. Is your CGP or percentage stopping you to attend top company interviews? But you code magics? Then ReLevel.com can offer you a job in the top companies like Razorpay, Urban Company, Upgrad, WebEngage and many more with their India's first hiring tournament platform. All the thing you need to do is just register through the link provided in the description Salaries are up to 15 LPA so serious coders don't miss this chance and candidates who have done online coaching from different training institutes this is a dream opportunity for you. There are three different tournaments business development, front end development and back end development and every tournament has two rounds prelims and mains. Prelims has three challenges and mains has two challenges. If you clear the mains, you will get mentoring sessions from the re-level team to help you with clearing the company interviews. Subscribers don't miss this opportunity. Registrations close on 22nd June 2021 and use promo code BIJ10 to avail 10% discount. Tournament begins on 26 June 2021. All the best and the links are there in the description. Let's see the first question. Without repetition using digits 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8 and 0, how many numbers can be made which lie between 500 and 1000? This question can be solved in two ways that is first one is without using the equation that is using the logic and the second one is using the equation. I will explain to you both the methods whichever you feel comfortable you can use. Let's see the first method. So here the number should lie between 500 and 1000. So it should be a three digit number. So it's clear that we cannot use 2, 3 and 4 in the first position because the number should lie between 500 and 1000. So the first digit can be 5, 6 or 8. That is total how many choices are possible? 3 choices are possible. Now in the question it is said that repetition is not allowed. So to fill the second position so at a time in the first position there will be one number so the remaining digits will be six no and out of the six numbers we can select one that is in the second position there will be six choices in the same way for the third position how many choices are the at a time first two digits filled means Two numbers are already being used. So remaining numbers is 5 out of 7. Right? So in the third position, how many possible ways are there? There are 5 choices. So how many numbers can be formed which lies between 500 and 1000? It is 3 into 6 into 5. 3 into 6 is 18. 18 into 5 is 90. Now, if in the question repetition is allowed, means how many possible numbers can be formed? In the first position, only three numbers are possible because the number should be greater than 500 and less than 1000. So, only possible chances is 5, 6 and 8. Three numbers are possible. But in the second and third position, any number can come out of the seven numbers so in the second position seven choices are there in the third position also seven choices are there because here repetition is allowed so how many numbers can be formed with repetition it is 3 into 7 into 7 3 into 7 is 21 21 into 7 is 147 numbers hope this is clear to everyone now using the equation also we can solve this Question. Let's see how we can solve this question using equation. We know that the number should be a three digit number. In the first position only three numbers can come. That is out of three numbers we can select one number. So since it is a problem based on selection we have to use combination. So 3C1 will come. 
into next one is in the second position one number is already being used so remaining six numbers will be the out of six we can select one number that is 6c1 into third position also remaining five numbers will be the five digits will be the because two we have already used so from this five digits we can select one so it will be 5c1 and always remember that nc1 is equal to n itself that is 3c1 is 3 5c1 is 5 6c1 is 6 so here the answer will be 3 into 6 into 5 again it will be 90 so for solving the questions based on combinations sometimes using equation you will be able to get the answer fast but sometimes usage of logic is easier let's see the next question four members form a group out of total eight members in how many ways it is possible to make the group if two particular members must be included so in this question there is a group of four members out of total eight members and we should form the group in such a way that two particular members must be included consider there are eight persons that is a b c d e f g and h so in the question it is said that we have to form a group of four members out of eight members right that is there are four places to be filled and it is also said that two particular members must be included that is in two positions always two people will be there that is if you are considering a and b always this a and b will be in that two positions so in that group two places are already filled remaining two positions we have to fill so how to select out of eight members two is already there in two positions so remaining six members will be the out of six people or six members we have to select two so how many possible ways are there it is six c two and the equation for six c two is that is n c r is n factorial divided by r factorial into n minus r factorial so six c 2 will be 6 factorial divided by 2 factorial into 4 factorial. So we know that 6 factorial is 6 into 5 into 4 factorial. So 4 factorial and 4 factorial will cancel. 6 into 5 is 30. 30 by 2 factorial. 2 factorial is nothing but 2 into 1. So 30 by 2 you will get the answer as 15. So it's time to wind up. I hope you all enjoyed this session. So we will be coming back with more interesting videos. So please do not forget to subscribe to our channel for more such videos. So thank you all and stay safe.